Now compiling code manually is fine, it's part of your build process, but it's better to automate that. So we'll start with the basic automation of Elm Reactor. Elm Reactor, or Elm Reactor, is a local web development server. It creates a web server on your local machine so you can open it and it feels like you're going to a web page, but it's actually loading from your machine, not from some remote server on the interwebs. If you hold Command or Apple and click links, or you can actually hover over hyperlinks in your terminal and click, it, click them and open them. And in our case, we're gonna go to localhost 8000. And at localhost 8000, this Elm Reactor will show your current project what dependencies it has reading from the Elm JSON. But if you navigate to an Elm file, it'll automatically compile and run it. Now, notice this one just kind of hangs because there's really no code to show. There's nothing actually to display. Reactor won't show it, that's okay, we'll come back to this. We'll hit back, we'll leave this here. I'm gonna go over here for a minute and close this. You do Control-C to stop it. I'll, let's go ahead and add some code to make Elm Reactor actually show something. 